Martine Besic, a seasoned actress with a rich cinematic history, has had a significant impact on many. Whether through her memorable performances or engaging on-screen presence, she has undoubtedly influenced the lives of those who have encountered her work. Can you recall a personal story where she served as a source of inspiration? Or perhaps, is there a special memory associated with her that holds a special place in your heart? Feel free to share your experiences in the comments below as we'd love to hear your stories and memories. Stay tuned for more insights into Martine Besic's career. There are plenty of interesting, surprising, and even touching facts coming up, so keep watching for a deeper dive into this classic actor's journey. And now we ask what's your most cherished memory or personal experience related to this talented individual? Share your thoughts and let the conversation unfold. Martine Basic, an accomplished actress with an impressive list of films, has made a significant impact on the world of cinema. Let's explore some of her well-known projects, shedding light on must-watch movies for both fans and newcomers. One of her standout roles is in the James Bond series. She appeared as Zora in From Russia with Love and later as Paula Kaplan in Thunderball. Bond fans will find these movies engaging, showcasing Basic's on-screen presence. For those who enjoy adventure, One Million Years B.C. is a highlight. The sixth performance as Nupandi in this prehistoric epic adds charm to the captivating storyline, making it essential for fans of classic cinema. In the horror genre, the sixth played Sister Hyde in Dr. Jekyll and Sister Hyde, showcasing her versatility. This film blends horror and suspense, offering a unique twist on a classic tale and highlighting the ability to navigate different genres. If you're new to Basic's filmography, a great starting point is Mantis and Lace. This psychedelic thriller demonstrates her ability to handle unconventional roles, providing viewers with a glimpse into the interesting facets of her acting skills. In the world of fantasy, Prehistoric Women is a captivating adventure where Basic's portrayal of the fierce Kari stands out. The film combines fantasy and adventure, offering an enjoyable cinematic experience. For a deeper look into Basic's work, Seizure is a psychological horror film that reflects her range as an actress. The movie explores themes of fear and paranoia, showcasing Basic's ability to bring depth to her characters. Whether you're a longtime admirer or a newcomer to Basic's cinematic contributions, these must-watch movies provide a compelling journey through her diverse filmography. Each film offers a unique glimpse into her talent, leaving a lasting impression on audiences. Martine Basic and Caroline Munro, close friends and co-stars in Hammer Horror Films and James Bond Eon franchise, share a lasting bond on and off screen. Their camaraderie adds an interesting layer to their collaborations, resonating with fans of both genres. In the end credits of Thunderball, Martine Basic is listed as Martin Biswat ICK, a unique choice that raises questions among fans. Despite her talent, Basic missed the chance to be the first leading James Bond girl in Dr. No, a role eventually taken by Ursula Andress. This setback didn't stop Basic from making her mark in the film industry through diverse roles. These glimpses into Basic's connections, credit quirks, and early career challenges offer a more nuanced understanding of her journey. It adds layers to the narrative of her cinematic contributions, making her body of work intriguing. The variations in credits and Basic's early career challenges contribute to a richer understanding of her cinematic journey. Her friendship with Caroline Munro and the missed opportunity in Doctor No show the ups and downs in her career, making her body of work more fascinating for fans. Martine Basic played notable roles in James Bond films, particularly as Zora in From Russia with Love and Paula Catlin in Thunderball. In the opening titles of From Russia with Love, she is listed as Martin Basic, a subtle quirk that adds an interesting nuance to her filmography. Her portrayal of the gypsy girl Zora and later as 07's Bahamian assistant Paula Catlin showcases her versatility as an actress. These roles in two well-known Bond films from the 1960s have become defining moments in her career, earning recognition among the public. Despite missing the opportunity to be the first leading James Bond girl in Dr. No, the sixth career didn't falter. Overcoming early challenges, she navigated through diverse roles, demonstrating resilience and determination. This aspect of her journey, coupled with variations in credits, adds depth to the narrative of her cinematic contributions. The sixth camaraderie with close friend and co-star Caroline Munro, evident in their collaborations in Hammer Horror Films and the James Bond Eon franchise, adds another layer to her off-screen connections. 
The end credits of Thunderball, where she is listed as Martin Biswet ICK, contribute to the curiosity surrounding her career. Beyond the Bond franchise, the six performances in films like One Million Years B.C., Dr. Jekyll and Sister Hyde, Mantis and Lace, and Prehistoric Women showcase her range as an actress. Her ability to seamlessly transition between genres from adventure to horror and fantasy highlights the essence of her on-screen presence. In conclusion, Martine Bissick's influence on cinema goes beyond her roles in Bond films. Her career, marked by interesting quirks, enduring friendships, and a willingness to tackle diverse roles, paints a nuanced picture of a talented actress whose influence has stood the test of time. Martine Bissick, a seasoned actress, faced both triumphs and personal struggles, shedding light on challenges beyond the glitz of the entertainment industry. Her cinematic journey is marked by notable roles, revealing the complexities she navigated off-screen. In terms of mental health, Bissick's resilience is evident. Despite early setbacks in her career, particularly missing the chance to be the first leading James Bond girl, she persevered, showcasing a strength that goes beyond the silver screen. Bissick maintained a lasting friendship with Caroline Munro, her co-star in Hammer Horror Films and the James Bond Eon franchise. Their camaraderie not only enhanced on-screen collaborations, but also provided mutual support in the face of industry demands. Variations in credits, like being listed as Martin Biswit ICK in the end credits of Thunderball, add to the intrigue surrounding her career. These subtle nuances underscore the intricacies of the entertainment world, where even a name change can become a point of curiosity for fans. Beyond the Bond franchise, the six performances in diverse genres from adventure in One Million Years B.C. to horror in Dr. Jekyll and Sister Hyde and fantasy in Prehistoric Women showcase her range as an actress. Her ability to seamlessly transition between different film landscapes highlights the diverse nature of her talent. In conclusion, Martine Bissick's journey is not just a reflection of her on-screen strength, but also a testament to the resilience needed to navigate the entertainment industry's complexities. Her experiences, both triumphs and tribulations, contribute to a richer understanding of her impact, transcending the roles she portrayed on screen. Martine Bissick made notable contributions to the James Bond series beyond her roles as Zora and Paula. In Thunderball, she shared a memorable moment with Sir Sean Connery. After a day of filming, Connery, known for his humor, playfully tossed his toupee at the set hairdresser, making everyone laugh. This incident reflects the friendly atmosphere on set. In From Russia with Love, Basic, a former Miss Jamaica, engaged in a fierce on-screen brawl alongside Ali Zagur, a former Miss Israel. Although the role of Tatiana went to Daniela Bianchi, Basic and Gur's portrayal of the two gypsy girls showcased their versatility and added excitement to the film. This behind-the-scenes glimpse into the casting process and the subsequent fight scene highlights the collaborative efforts that contribute to a film's success. The six Miss Jamaica title is another aspect of her life. This achievement, although not directly related to her acting career, sheds light on the diverse experiences that have shaped her. The title not only speaks to her beauty, but also hints at the different aspects of her journey. Her connection with Caroline Munro, both on and off screen, is a recurring theme in the six narrative. Beyond their collaborations in Hammer Horror Films and James Bond, their friendship becomes a crucial element in understanding the actress behind the roles. Such bonds in the competitive industry offer a glimpse into the support systems crucial for navigating challenges. Despite missing the opportunity to be the first leading James Bond girl in Dr. No, the six resilience propelled her forward. Her roles in Thunderball and From Russia with Love became defining moments, showcasing her ability to adapt and excel in diverse characters. The variations in credits, like being listed as Martin Biswan ICK in Thunderball, add a layer of intrigue, emphasizing the subtle complexities within the entertainment world. In essence, Martine Bissick's journey is a mosaic of experiences from humorous anecdotes with Sean Connery to the dynamics of casting decisions and beauty pageants. Her versatility and resilience, coupled with friendships, contribute to a deeper understanding of her on- and off-screen presence.